the device that aided in the search for a missing man in Cameron Parish. The sheriff's office explains how they are using a drone in their search and rescue operations. The body of a Texas man who went missing this past Monday near the Johnson Bayou area was found by the Cameron Parish Sheriff's Office by drone Tuesday. Staff Sergeant Scott Guillory says the drone gave them the ability to observe a large area from the air. It shortened our search time probably by four or five days. I flew the drone a total of 10 hours over two days and was able to uh, locate the missing person. Not only can the drone aid in search and rescue operations, but it can also be used for intelligence gathering for search warrants, suspects on the run or escaped, and in assisting with large fires to find hot spots through thermal imaging and infrared features on the drone. Uh, we can use it, especially the infrared part of it or the uh, thermal imaging, whereas if at night we can actually access and locate a suspect by his heat signature and we can actually lock on and track that guy with the drone. The drone has a 200 times a zoom camera allowing the operator to see people about two miles out and large vehicles at five miles out. The drone has a capability of flying three miles away from the remote. Uh, we have to keep it in, in line of sight for F per FAA regulations. Cameron Parish Sheriff's Office has three certified drone operators. We're glad to have these guys, but so we have three so they can respond to any incident and, and be able to go and do what they need to do. But uh, to do that and to get all the equipment and all the accessories, we're probably about $70,000 into this program so far. Staff Sergeant Guillory says the drone is a big asset to their operations.